Take me seriously, but only a little bit. Hey guys, it is Thursday here on Daily Grace, and you know what that means. Daily Grace is gonna teach you how to do something. My brother got me an edible arrangement and I juiced it. If that's not love, I don't know what is. I don't. I went on the Daily Grace Facebook page and I asked you guys, what did you want to learn how to do today? And someone said, teach us how to do One Direction themed nails. I know you love them. Show us, show us, show us. Do it, Grace. You are aggressive in the annoying way. But I decided that today I will teach you a One Direction nail tutorial. It's convenient because yesterday I bit off all of my nails. So they're in the perfect shape for this because sometimes One Direction looks a little rough around the edges, let's be honest. I'm not even going to take off the nail polish that I have on here from before because One Direction is influenced by boy bands that have come before them. So really they're just capitalizing on the path that has been paved previously for them in the 60s, 70s, 80s, and 90s. And 10s. F and metaphor out the butt. First I'm going to start with Harry Styles. And I'm going to put him on the thumb because he's pretty cool. And he's probably had a thumb up his butt before. What are some attributes that Harry Styles is known for? His hair, right? And he's got brown hair, so I'm gonna take a cotton ball and shush it like this. And I have brown nail polish. And I'm just gonna paint the cotton ball brown. And then I'm gonna paint my nail a little bit so it sticks. Get in there. More brown on top. Ooh, great. You're insecure. I don't know what for. Your hair looks great. Can you see it? Can you see it? Harry Styles is done. Now we're gonna move on to Zayn Malik. Zayn Malik is the ethnic looking one. So I'm gonna continue with my brown, just as a base coat on this nail. I mean, his hair is brown, people. Don't get all offended. If God wanted us to get offended over color, he'd make us all colorblind. Okay, so we start with a nice brown base coat. And then there's been a lot of stories lately that Zayn cheated on his girlfriend with a, an Australian hooker stripper. So we are going to take a pair of women's underwear and we're just gonna wrap it around the nail. Ooh, yeah. Zane and Harry, it looks identical. Next, we're gonna move on to Niall. And Niall is pretty boring. He wears blue a lot and he's blonde. I don't have yellow nail polish, unfortunately, so I'm just gonna use blue. Also, Niall's kind of not that great looking. So we're just gonna take this blue and just do whatever the f you want. Oh, so good so far. Also, I looked up some pictures of Niall and he tends to break out in pimples a lot. So we're gonna take some um, pimple cream I have here, can you see it? I'm just gonna put it right on top. You can just put that around. That looks gross. Should have found a different pimple cream. Then we've got Louie, and let's just be frank. Louie's got a gay face out the butt, so I'm gonna use my pink. Bright, bright pink. I have a couple tulip petals that fell off of uh, tulips that I have that we're just gonna stick in there. It kinda looks a little phallic too, which is classic Louie. And then the last member to me is very forgettable, so I'm just not even gonna paint this now. There you go, there is my One Direction inspired nail tutorial. I hope that you try this on your own and wear it to any formal event that you might have coming up. Prom, this is a really fun way to do it. And if you get your period during your prom, you have a spare pair of underwear at your fingertips. Bye! Orgy.